Hello everybody, it is Daniel here for a mod showcase. Today I am very excited to bring to you a very, very cool mod that I discovered on the forums today. When I saw it, I my mouth immediately dropped. It is based on one of my favorite animes, if not my favorite anime of all time. Sword Art Online. Very funny that there's Japanese letters on the screen right now. Um, basically, it puts the UI or user interface uh, from Sword Art Online into Minecraft. And they did a fabulous job, if you ask me. So, as you can see, we are in Minecraft slash Sword Art Online. We have a health bar up top, our username, as well as our level. And then on the right, we have our hot bar for the items that we have in our inventory. If I press escape, this comes up. It will have our equipment, items, skills, just various various information as well as options. Um, one thing that I do change about this mod is the crosshair. The crosshair is automatically off when you first come in, but I definitely want that on. You can also make the uh, set the inventory back to the default inventory. You can also change the UI back to normal and access your normal options here. And you can't leave the game. <laughs> this is the funniest part of this mod. When you when you you would think that this button is the exit, and I clicked on it, I was like, oh gosh, I can't leave. And then I laughed at myself, like this is just like Sword Art Online. But actually, if you click help, it'll uh, take you to where you can leave the game. As you can see, the oops, the cows have a green dot over them, so, kind of like Sims. Players will also have this this green dot. Or marker and they also have uh, health bars around them and this and this is true for every mob so when you hit the mob you'll see how much health they have left and how close they are to death and that's also really cool um, let me go ahead and kill one of these things you get a nice little sound effect whenever you kill a mob as well um, one thing that I do want to mention is you you may find the inventory to be a little bit confusing at first so let's go to because when you press E usually what opens up is your uh, crafting and your inventory but this is what comes up so you can see your items and you can scroll through these and basically let's, let's, just, let's say you want to put something in your hotbar you click on one of these white items um, not the ones that are equipped onto your body though so you can put let's say this leather take it out of your hotbar or you can scroll down and you'll obviously have more items and you can then put more items into your hotbar. So it's actually not that complicated, but it, it does take a little bit of getting used to. Then you can go to to, uh, to your crafting by just... I don't know what this does. Yeah, I don't think that does anything. Whoa. I don't even know what that does. Hold up. Okay, so basically you can make it so you automatically sprint. I just I just noticed that. By going to your skills and clicking on uh, sneaking or, or sprinting. I assume sneaking will do the same for sneaking. But then you can click on crafting and t here, you, here you'll be in crafting. Hold on, let me see about a crafting table. I'm pretty sure if you click on a crafting table, it'll automatically just open the crafting table. There won't be any, any confusion there. Yeah. So yeah, this mod is awesome, if you ask me. It puts the Sword Art Online user interface into Minecraft gives it a futuristic um, type of feel and I really have no complaints it has all the options that one would want in there you know to have access to and yeah so please do leave a like and subscribe if you're if you enjoyed this mod show showcase and uh, check out my other videos I have a uh, ongoing daily let's play that will never end and if you're looking for uh, for more mods, please do leave suggestions in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time. Peace.